Yos Suseli received an award as the Journalist of the Year 2022 Nigeria Service Award in Abuja, the Federal Capital Territory, FCT. Also, TVC News correspondent Ola Awakon won the Television Production of the Year at the Nigeria Media Merit Award, NMAE. On Sunday, let's share the story with you. The media plays a vital role in shaping the society. In Nigeria, like other countries across the world, journalism is one of the noblest of professions as practitioners usually get recognized for their hard work and contributions to society. In recent times, a lot has changed and most journalists no longer get the recognitions they deserve. This is not unconnected to the growing impression by the society that more journalists now prefer to propagate fake news due to the influence of brown envelopes. It has undermined public trust in the media and eroded the integrity of the profession. Among the flock of wolves, there are still journalists who do their jobs diligently and who refuse to be swayed by money. Service world will be least of the year. And he is from TVC. Please help me to welcome Ayo Ezekiel Ozuka. I'm sure you can celebrate him some more. Let's put it here. Civil society organizations have decided to honor and appreciate those journalists and other Nigerians who are doing well in their professions over the years. At this ceremony, TVC News political correspondent Ayo Ezekiel Ozubakun bagged the Journalist of the Year Award for the program Journalist Hangouts. He and other journalists who bag the words urge those in the profession to be passionate about their jobs and keep telling the truth with verifiable information. Do more in terms of being a watchdog, to do more in terms of bringing the best to the people, to do more in terms of researching more, knowing what our leaders are doing, knowing what our politicians are up to, knowing how to inform people effectively and knowing how to tell people the truth at always without any slant. So it's always to be balanced, objective, and not biased at any given time. Going all out uh, to tell the stories, going all out for uh, development of our communities and our country. Other recipients of various awards urge everyone to do what they can to create positive impacts on their societies as people will notice their efforts and it will be eventually appreciated. We person trying as much as possible in their own little spaces to do something that will positively impact the space that they find themselves. To provide sustainable living for the environment, let us always do more in the area of education, in the area of health, environment and what have you. So should be a worthy ambassador to the Nigerian Service Award so that when people see them tomorrow, they should be able to say, okay, fine, they truly deserve the award. They award recipients are happy for the recognition given to them for rendering services to the nation's development and encourage others to play their part in nation building. Mari Mohamed, TVC News, Abuja. This gives me joy, it gives me happiness, and I believe that uh, this is what journalism should stand for, um, pro uh, professionalism, and I'm so happy, I'm so delighted, and I feel that um, this, this is time for us to begin to do more, uh, to do more to add to the humanity, development of the society, and in, in general. So I'm so happy for this award, and I thank the organizers of the Nigerian Media Merit Award for this, and um, recognizing excellence in the media space. It's, it's, I'm, so, I'm just so excited. This is like the third or fifth time, or the third or fourth time that I will be you know, nominated, and for me to win this today it shows that I am being recognized for the good job I'm doing in the media space. Our own Ola Awako and um, Chile. And our own Ayo Zuba. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our very own. Oh, what do you say? Your own Ayo Zuba. <laughs> <laughs> so it's good uh, to be honored um, for the work that we do. We receive a lot of insults. Honestly. For doing this work. And um, <laughs> <laughs> yes, sometimes you just wonder what's going on. Honestly. What have we done? Honestly. You know, um, because the bitterness to speak the truth mm. is um, is something that if most people had a choice, 
they would rather not do. People will tell you, ah, say when they come to one bed, are you the only one? Eh? Why, why must you let them hear it from your mouth? But the truth is by nature self-evident. You can abuse us from now till tomorrow. <laughs> we won't stop. And because that is what majority of the people get. The truth is, our people appreciate what we are doing. The yeah. ordinary mm. folks out I'm there, sorry. ordinary people out there appreciate what we are doing. Mm. The mm. people who abuse us, it is their problem. As long as we know that we are providing joy for the greater majority of our people who treasure the truth, honestly, whatever anybody says does not bother me. All those spaces where people can make comments, abuse people that they are not good enough to lace their boots. I no longer read them. I will not oh, read listen. them. Uh -huh. so, yes. Go to YouTube, abuse people. See, yeah, yeah, you're good for nothing. Mm -hmm. uh, look at that about you. They all too know. He <laughs> thinks he knows everything. Oh, if we think we know everything, why are we bringing people to come and answer questions on our programs? I mean, when you hear, when you hear say, someone saying, oh, Mr. No, when he's called, he's, he's jealous of the fact that you are a reservoir of knowledge. It's as simple as that. He's just beefing you because of the knowledge that God has deposited in you. It's not, nothing else. Nothing else. Oh, he, he assumes that he knows everything. <laughs> Mr. Two, no. I know I'm representing again this year. Yeah, he's becoming, a, he's becoming a pattern. And I, like Gide said, there's a robot saying, Olo told Lenny, a truthful person does not really have friends because truth itself doesn't need friends. Mm. It's the truth. As we say in Yoruba, if the lads be running, galloping for 20 years, it takes the, the truth only one day to catch up. Mm. So whatever the program has achieved, if you weigh those who are against the program and those who are for it, those who are for it are the greater majority. Mm. And I know this because wherever one goes, People appreciate what General East Anger is mm -hmm. doing for them. Yeah. And they are very happy because on this program, they see most of the time, they see balance that uh, other programs do not offer. Because yeah. we go out of our way to make sure everything is balanced and the nuances are something that they can work with. Congratulations, Ayo. You are always an award winner. I don't know why this is strange. But we prefer to get no, money. It's not, a, it's not as if it is strange. We sat down here are you and I, and veterans of the Nigerian Civil War, they brought awards to come and give us. We didn't know them. I remember. From Adam. War veterans, yes. people yeah. fought in the Civil War. Yeah. They, they, they came two together, years. presented um, awards to Are you and mm. I. Mm. Unfortunately, my own was burnt in that fire. Yes. It's one of the regrets that I Mama. have. Because mm. I didn't know these people. You see, the things that we do, we just do our best. I know. We just do our best. And mm. in the eyes of the good people in our country, majority of them, our best has been good enough. Our best has been deserving of awards here and there. We can't mm. count how many times do we win awards. Mm. It's not a, but occasionally, we talk about it, oh, we are rewarded 